Estill County leaders spent the morning testing two schools in a landfill for radiation levels. They're double-checking state tests after state leaders confirmed earlier this week radioactive waste was illegally dumped at the Blue Ridge landfill. Mike Byer talked to county leaders about what they're calling a serious situation. It's been a stressful few days for Estill County leaders like Judge Executive Wallace Taylor. They're going to pay for this. This after radioactive waste from operations in Ohio, Pennsylvania, and West Virginia were illegally sent to the Blue Ridge landfill between July and November of last year. This leaves Taylor asking, Why would they do that? Until that question can be answered, Taylor just wants to make sure that it never happens again. I'm not blaming the landfill 100%, not whatsoever, but there has to be a better way to monitor this type of situation. A situation county leaders say they are taking very seriously, especially with the high school and middle school sitting a stone's throw away. We want to assure the public that there's no danger for the students. Now Judge Taylor says they're not just going to look over the area where the radioactive waste was dumped, but he says they're going to cover every inch of this landfill to make sure there is no health threat to the public. To make sure this is true, on Friday, the county hired a state agency to come run some tests on the schools. Their findings were very much what we expected and what we hoped for, uh, that there's no evidence uh, of any contamination on our grounds. To be sure, both the county and schools wanted a second opinion. That's why today they hired an independent group to check out the schools once again. When we're able to, uh, to back that up with, uh, with sound research and testing, then you know that, that makes us feel better about what we're doing. The independent agency also spent the majority of the afternoon running tests in the landfill. Although Taylor believes there is no danger to the public, he wants to be 100% sure. We're going to get to the bottom of this. It may take a few more days, but we will find out. I will not stop until we do. In Estill County, Mike Byer, WKYT. All of the testing has cost the county over $10,000. Taylor says the landfill will reimburse the county for those costs.